It was an out-of-conference matchup with huge playoff potential. Welcome to the Full Court Press. I'm your host, Tim Hanna. Vinton County traveled up Route 50 to face the Washington Courthouse Blue Lions. And for more, we welcome Vikings reporter Noah Cavan. That's right. VC took the trip to Washington Courthouse to throw down with the Blue Lions in a game with massive playoff implications. The Blue Lions were able to fend off the Vikings, winning by a score of 62-55. to So we saw the Blue Lions dominate early, taking a 24-11 lead just two minutes into the second. How did the Vikings flip the switch? Well, VC originally lined up in a man-to-man -man defense, but after falling behind by as many as 13 points, Coach NJ Kite decided to change it up to a 2-3 zone. This proved to be effective, and the Vikings cut the lead to just four points at the half. But what a turnaround. Uh, as VC was able to keep things rolling in the second half. Well, the Vikings offense was still going strong in the third quarter, but the Blue Lions were going even stronger. Washington kept feeding the rock to stars such as Garrett Rickman and Isaiah Haithcock, who each dropped 18 points. John Wall was also huge for Washington, scoring 16 points, snagging four rebounds, and swiping the ball away three times. So this was a tough loss for VC, but what can they learn from this moving forward? Well, Vinton County shouldn't hang their head after this loss. The Vikings are working the kinks out and seem to be on the cusp of reaching their full potential. Garrett Brown dropped 20 points tonight, and point guard Cobra Sharp knocked down three shots from behind the arc, as well as dishing out five assists and rebounding the ball four times. And this was their last chance to improve their playoff seeding since the cutoff date is on Friday, but VC will have a perfect opportunity to bounce back on Saturday, where they play host to the 14-5 Jacks 9 men. The Vikings will have a perfect opportunity to bounce back, especially with a couple of tough games left on their schedule. Thanks, Noah. For more on this game, as well as others across the TVC, be sure to tune into Episode 4 of Hardwood Heroes this Sunday at 11 p.m. on WOUB and the WOUB YouTube channel. In the meantime, be sure to stay up to date with all of our digital content on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and of course, WOUB.org heroes. Until then, we're reminding you to be heroic.